She's the actress, singer and dancer who's been recognised with the Top Theatre Prize. In 2015, Elise McCann was introduced to TV audiences as Peter Allen's sister in the acclaimed miniseries, Not the Boy Next Door. And last year, she hit a high note again with a Helpman Award for her role in Matilda the Musical. When I grow Just because you find that life's not fair, it does mean that you just have to grin and bear it. Now the performer is bringing the work of Roald Dahl to the stage. Annalise McCann joins us live at the desk. Hi, Elise. Hi, nice to see you. Thank you for having me. Well, we're going to talk about the new album in a moment, but yes. let's wind the clock back to the Peter Allen miniseries. Yes. Such a popular, hugely popular show. What was it like to be a part of it? Oh, it was amazing. It was... I had so much fun on that set. Pretty much, I was very, very lucky. I, um... My character was there to kind of, um, facilitate the, the life family story of Peter Allen. And so he, um you know, was really, really close with his family. And so it meant that all, almost every scene I did was with Joel and Beck Gibney, who were just rock stars at everything they do. Yeah. So it made it just in incredibly fun and also just really special. It was a really awesome group of people. Yeah, yeah. I bet. And then you went on to win a Helpman uh, for your role as Miss Honey yes. in the Tilt of the Musical. Did yes. that change your career, do you think, winning the, that award? Um, I think it did. I actually think being cast in that role originally actually was one of the big changes for me um, just because the amount of people that go to see Matilda is huge like it's had I think they sold their millionth ticket when it was in um, Brisbane or Perth so yeah. it, the, the gross amount of people that have seen it and and just the, the piece is so awesome it's truly one of the best things I've ever done yeah probably that, the best show I've ever done and that's actually. all thanks to the genius that is Tim Minchin yeah uh, what absolutely. was it like working with him oh he is such a cool guy. He is such a crazy genius. He um, he's so much fun. He's really down to earth. He's he's like the guy that all of a sudden one day I just rocked up to my dressing room and he was like, "Hey, I'm just using your bathroom." And I was like, "Oh, okay, great." <laughs> like he's, no he's just so chill. He's he's really awesome. Yeah, yeah. really cool guy. Yeah. Um, you're now starring in Dallas. I am. Tell us about that. Well, Dallas basically it was originally the idea for this album, and then we kind of developed it into a, a stage show, um, and it's an album using all different music from different adaptations of Roald Dahl stories. So there's stuff from Matilda, things from the original Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory movie, things from Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, um, and then we have these revolting rhymes that have been, have uh, original compositions that have been made for them. Um, so there's lots of different music and we kind of wanted to put like a darker edge on it, so kind of bring it back to that Roald Dahl kind of vibe. So the whole thing, um, the, the show is kind of a show about elements of Roald Dahl that you wouldn't necessarily know, so parts of his life that have kind of informed all of his music and it's it's a bit absurd and it's a bit funny and mm, sounds lots, magical lots yeah. of heavy strings lots of strings so we yeah. have a string in this um show that you're seeing over here um we have a string quintet and heaps of tuned percussion so like xylophones and marimbas yeah, and glockenspiels and, yeah. and yeah and to give it also the element of magic which is yeah. awesome about dal um, so, and yeah. you recently performed it at the Adelaide Cabaret Festival. Yes. How was it received by audiences? Oh, it was awesome. Yeah. What was so cool is that um, we originally went to make it for all ages, which is a really hard thing to do, mm. I've discovered. Um, you're, ter you're constantly terrified that someone's going to be bored. Um, but it was, it was awesome. We had lots of great kids in the audience, but heaps of adults that just responded so well. And it was, yeah, it went wonderfully. Stuff. Thanks. Brilliant. Lovely to talk to you, Elise. Yeah, thank you. Thank you so much, Elise. Elise's album is available from tomorrow, and for more information about the Dalesque show, just head across to our website.